good afternoon. Today is the 13th of August and I had today's video all planned nicely. Unfortunately, the best laid plans of mice and men don't always turn out how you expect. I went over this morning to deliver my car to Jordan, who, as you know, fitted the new plastic thermostat housing to my 2003 Rover 45 V6 2 litre connoisseur and um, he finished the work on the car which is fitting the new inlap manifold plus uh, a part for the cruise control mechanism and he asked me to go and pick the car up before it started raining. Now I uh, delayed this for a couple of hours because well no particularly good reason and um, now we've ended up with this. The roads run easily are totally flooded. I was going to go and buy a new shower curtain this afternoon but um, I don't think that's a very good idea. Um, yeah. A bit of a contrast from yesterday's weather I must say. Anyway, uh, what I wanted to talk about today is opposed, uh, you know, as opposed to just the weather, which I know we do a lot about in this country at the moment, is we're going to be doing another question and answer session tomorrow, that is Friday the 14th. Um, I shall be recording that tomorrow afternoon. Some of you have already submitted questions because I put the fact that I was going to be um, recording one of those in the community um, post section yesterday afternoon. So uh, please don't forget to put your comments down below this video um, as to what sort of things you want to ask. Obviously keep it uh, keep it legal and all that kind of thing. Um, there are certain things like, you know, attempted coups of Latvia and other things in my past which I don't wish to talk about for, uh, you know, political reasons, but uh, the rest of it will have to uh, um, answer, I suppose. Second thing is, is that I am looking for some new cars to review for no budget reviews and tweed jacket reviews. Now, no budget reviews is a pretty simple format because in no budget reviews, have to be ones that you can buy an example of in good condition with an MOT for less than a thousand pounds and that's really it. Some of the cars I've featured on no budget reviews are worth far more than a thousand pounds because they are much nicer examples than that. Others of course were you know, obtained for less than 500 pounds in some cases so that's really the limit of it and uh, you know I do film things outside of, um, of Hampshire where I'm based. Uh, I have done no budget reviews actually or, you know in uh, West Midlands twice for example and I've got a, um, a viewer who um, asked, asked me to go up to Lake District to do one of those which I'll be doing later in the year um, but that is all you need to know really uh, for anything to do with offering cars for review please send an email to japl745 at hotmail.com Mr. Franks and I are also looking at filming the next episodes of, of uh, Tweed Jacket Reviews. We've got a f some filming scheduled for the 24th and 25th of August. Um, if you are actually based in um, the West Country, we're particularly looking um, for cars in the sort of, I think, um, Froome, Bath area. Then uh, please do get in touch. But these are cars which you know, definitely can't be bought for um, £1,000 in any sort of way. Um, some of the Tree Jacket Reviews cars, they date back to the 60s. Some are brand new ones, so there's a very wide remit for those as well. Um, tends to be the ones I prefer to do with very new cars or sort of older cars. Uh, those are the ones which I tend to do most of all. Of I've done loads of sort of things, so um, if you do have a car that you'd like me to feature on Tree Jacket Reviews, then same thing please, um, send me an email to uh, japl745 at hotmail.com Obviously whenever you send, send me an email about something you have to state your um, location and what the sort of car is. I, I don't take every single um, offer I get for a number of reasons. One of them is it's a car which is just in a particular location that would be um, difficult to reach 
um, unless you know we were staying over there and uh, you know if, if there's nothing else around there then that can be a bit of a problem you know if it be the cost involved of doing that and just doing one as opposed to doing three which is what Mr Franks and I would normally do can be a bit prohibitive if it is something that for example, Mr. Richardson and I, uh, he, he tends to do the one-off ones for me, like the Sending to Williams Richardson filmed and did that uh, for one for me. Then um, that's a bit more sort of uh, straightforward. If you know he, we 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 can get to um, the, the location, film the car, you know, there and back in the course of the day, that's not really a problem. That tends to be, you know, within the southeast, we tend to do that. Um, so that's really it. There will be the question and answer session tomorrow. Um, I would like to speak a bit more about this rover and tell you what exactly we've done to it so far and the costs involved of running a car like this are. Um, but I, I can't film that today, it's far too wet. Um, I need to go and dry off myself, um, which I'm sure of you, many of you will find very amusing. Um, but there we go. So don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more entertaining content or entertaining depending on your point of view. Um, don't forget to like this video and leave a comment below. Um, don't forget to visit as well Facebook, facebook.com forward slash Lloyd Vehicle Consulting and also Instagram, instagram.com forward slash Lloyd underscore vehicle underscore consulting. Thank you ever so much indeed once again for watching.